Okay, so doing some renovating here. Uh, this is the guest room. There was a headboard uh, nailed and screwed to that wall. And uh, there was border all the way around the room, uh, wallpaper border. And then there was border around where the crown mold area is. And uh, my little brother was nice enough to come in here and rip it down for me. Scrape it off. I'm learning that that's a huge pain because I'm doing it in the kitchen. But on this wall, there was uh, like cork board and a mirror. And we peeled all the cork, the cork board off and there's all this construction adhesive all over the wall. So I've been trying to figure out how to get that off of there. So I got the scraper here. I've been sanding and I'm like, you're still gonna see that. You're gonna see a line once it's painted. So my buddy, who's a painter, came over and uh, we're going to mud this today. Um, we scraped all the high chunks off, sanded a bit, and then he's gonna put a skim coat of mud on there. It's not a big wall. And then where, where the uh, cork board ended all the different layers of paint over the years, it left a ridge all the way up the wall. So he's going to fade the, uh, or taper the mud into the rest of the wall here. Uh, let me see. Back up here. That wall is only, I don't know, six, seven feet wide. Um, and then the doorway. So it's a small room. It's like ten 10 feet this way, 11 feet this way. Uh, but, got to fix it up. He painted the ceiling already, so that is done. And he has primed the windows and caulked. He says it doesn't have to look pretty. He does this all day long, so the, uh, uh, the primer doesn't look great, but it's, uh, it's going to keep the, uh, that yellow, it's like old yellow wood from coming through. And it's cocked already. When we, we're gonna go pick up some mud and some kills, primer for the walls, and then uh, come back, light sand them, and do the uh, Sherwin Williams Pro Classic satin white on the windows. So everything will look good then. There's the rubber band ball. Check it out, wrapped in plastic. That's the 150 pounder. I know people are uh, asking about that. Uh, the other one is out in my sunroom, all wrapped up because air, uh, oxygen makes uh, latex rot. So uh, I transported them to the house all wrapped up. Actually I had a safe mover do it. I'll talk about that in another video. They're not easy to move, those things. Uh, but anyway, that's that. I'll keep on keeping on here, and I'll check back in. Take her easy.